hello and welcome. Before I can repot some of my bonsai, I have to prepare my pots. And one of the things I got for preparation is this mesh from the fabulous Weigert's Bonsai Nursery in North Fort Myers. There's a picture on the back of this packaging and I'll show you what that looks like to give you a little idea. It's kind of blurry in the video, so let me put this clip up here for you. They put the mesh above the holes in the pot so that the soil doesn't leach out when you water it. So that's what I'm going to do. Cut the mesh. So let's actually get some wire cutters. And it turns out the wire cutters aren't working that great. So let's grab some scissors. Well, geez, that's so much easier. So I guess it's not real wire. So we'll cut these little squares for the bottom of the cascade pot. Let's cut another one for the next pot. And then for the larger pot. And there we have it. One mesh square for each of our pot holes. And then we'll be ready to move on to the next step. Let's see if you can see it here, if I get it at the right angle. Okay. got this through we'll bend it over and let me find my little wire wire thingies and let's just bend this in so I don't need to cut it in case I need to use the full length of it at some point so there we there we go all right one cascade pot down and I think uh, I think that'll work yeah Okay, and let's work on this other one here. All right, that one's done. Okay. Now the next part of our repotting process will be to prepare this wiring for tie downs. So it will hold the bonsai root securely in the pot and to keep the mesh securely down in the pots. So we'll just kind of weave this wire in through the mesh, try to pull it out the other side and Try to get the wire secure and flat on the bottom so we've got the full length on both sides here and this is what we'll use to wrap around the roots to secure the bonsai inside. And this next one will do the same thing. And there we have it. We've got our second one. Okay, and now for the big one. So what we've got are these little holes here that we can thread the wire through and that will give us its own space to secure the wire and ultimately secure the bonsai root. So let's just measure this and see how long we want to go. And this looks about 
right and let's clip it about here okay and we'll feed the other one through and we'll just double this up measure it trim the second one start and put our mesh pieces in first there we go thread this through the mesh where's that can work there's my other one okay let's make the second one here measure this out because you know I like symmetry and balance so there we go clip this one and that looks about right we'll bend these into a U shape and get the mesh in its place thread this one down get the next piece of mesh thread that through there just like that. Now I'll try to hold these down while I flip the pot over. And pull them securely. Lost one. It's alright. So we'll pull this tight, bend those over, find a first one, put that back in. Now we'll secure it. Boom, just like that. Now for the longer ones, these are the tie downs that will be wrapped around the root. So this looks about right. A bigger U shape. Move these. those through the hole. Sometimes these pots, um, the hole is a little tough to get in the first time, so sometimes you might have to force it like that. And then the second one, there we go. And I'll try to get it to come all the way through. And again, sometimes with the newer pots, you got to Use your tools and a little bit of strength and try to get everything working for you. Felt like it was tight, but we still got a ways to go. So let me try to push this in there and pull on this side. And it's a little, a little tough. <laughs> Sometimes you need a little bit of strength. I know I'm not making it look easy. <laughs> it seems like it is, but dang. All right, here. Tighten these. I'm sure I won't be working on anything much bigger than this for a while, but there we go. All right, so that one's ready for bonsai. And this little one and that little one. Exciting. And there we have it. Thanks for watching. <laughs>